10-0 lead for Brown as we get our third bout underway. Blake Saito just came out and pinned Connor McDonald. In the 150-157 pound division. Now the 165 division, Calvin Pineda, Keegan Rothrock. Nothing yet for Rothrock. And there's the takedown, three points. This Pioneers team coming off a loss to LIU, lost 41 to three to the Sharks. Their last time out. Rothrock looking for three more. Not yet. But the riding time at 40 seconds. See Pineda trying to work from under Rothrock to no avail. Minute 10 to go. Pineda trying to escape. A quick point and gain leverage. Not yet. Now Rothrock trying to turn Pineda back over. Get him on his back. And still unable to get the escape point is Pineda. He'll have a chance to do so on the whistle and get on the board. The first period that's been controlled by Rothrock, but just the one takedown so far. 45 seconds to go in the first. Pineda in trouble. Will he get pinned? Not quite. Rothrock added it four, but he'll pick up four points. Up to a seven nothing advantage. He'll try again. Does he get the fifth second this time? Not quite, he wants it. And for the second pin in as many bouts. and runs out of time in the first period. He'll get four more points, however, and go into the second up 11-0. Talk about a strong first period for Keegan Rothrock. Did everything but pin Calvin Pineda in the final minute of that first period. Rothrock beginning to close in. On technical fall territory. Is dominated to this point. Minute 20 to go in the second. Now down to a minute. And Pineda not able to get anything going. 
evades Rothrock, but still not on the board. Rothrock up by 12. Pineda, can he gain leverage? No. Riding time at 2.02. Pineda in trouble. And that's three more points. That's a technical fall. Rothrock picks up the win and adds to the Bears' lead. Fifteen zero. The score in the hundred sixty five pound division.